All right. Well, let's move on to the last one of this week. Uh, we have, I don't know how many people okay. here subscribe to Peacock. Is it a subscription, right? It is. It is a subscription. It's my understanding that, and I don't know if Hulu still does this because I haven't subscribed to Hulu in a long time. But back in the day, Hulu was like you had free Hulu, mm -hmm. and then you had like paid Hulu. And right. the the free one, it was ad supported, but you also you didn't get like the entire catalog. You just got like select episodes of shows here and there, kind of thing. I think they um, still kind of do that. Yeah, so Peacock. Peacock has a free plan, but you don't get everything, and it's ad supported. Right. Um, so you get like some shows, you get some episodes. Like, you don't even get like a whole show. Like, say, like Friends is on the free plan. Like, right, you don't right. get the entire show. You get like a few seasons or a few episodes here and there. Oh. Okay. Um, but Peacock is, for the most part, you get subscriptions, and then I think they even have like an ad-free subscription, which costs even more, kind of thing. Hmm. But yeah. So, uh, but yeah, Peacock. We actually talked about this on the show. Um, months ago four or five months ago or something like that uh that they are developing a game show based on the 80s arcade game frogger mm. and it was one of those things where it's like wow that's that's going to be interesting and uh we finally have a commercial it's Yay! on their youtube page you go to peacock's youtube page and you can now see what frogger with starring the comedic talents of damon wayans jr as the host um, that's so weird look at uh yeah this is like people are jumping across a waterway uh, in kind of like an obstacle course kind of scenario trying to not fall into the water it's wipe out that's and it's it. like uh, is this really game. like is this really a 30 minute show like like I mean, now, now, granted, I, I know about you all. I'm old. I grew up on Double Dare, if you all remember that oh, show, yes. on, like, Nickelodeon, that. where stuff like this happened all the time on Double Dare, mm -hmm. right? This is like the physical challenge, you know. And it's like, so that's that. That to me is what this is. Like Frogger should like this. This what they just showed off should be part of another show. Like maybe if yeah. something went wrong, or they could choose to do a, it like some kind of event like this. Give me guts again. I'm, I miss that. Guts. Thing. That that was cool. But like for this, I was like, I was watching this this commercial, and I was like, Are you kidding me? This is like this looks like a complete waste of time. Um, I I watch American Ninja Warrior. I love it. I'm like hooked on that show. What so was the, what was the other one that had like American voiceovers, and it was just like this. It was Wipeout, I think. Well, so there's Wipeout. There's the original Ninja Warrior, which is called Sasuke. And then there was like Unbeatable Banzuke. And then like... Yeah. <laughs> but this is like, I just don't see the... Now, okay. Oh, hold I'm, on. A, I'm an old out of shape guy. I'm, I'm not saying <laughs> I could do this any, by any means. I'm not I'm not claiming that this is easy or that I could do it. Yeah. I'm just saying this this doesn't seem entertaining enough to warrant a now, 30 minute TV okay, show. Okay, hold on now. Here's the thing. Yeah. Netflix had has something very similar to this. Okay. It's called The Floor is Lava. Yes. Okay. So Netflix heard of that. So I've Netflix that. actually yeah. gained some traction by that Most show. extreme elimination. There you go. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 So Netflix had a really good run with The Floor is Lava. It had like a like a blip of, of popularity, right? And I, I yeah. still think people watch it. It's just not as not where it was at its peak of its time. I yeah. think this is a direct competitor to that. Okay. I think I think people are looking for mindless game show that either makes you laugh or something like that but it's it's just simple tv that's not trying to yeah. be something epic there's a place for these things the fact that it touches on a video game thing for us just makes it that much more funny to make fun of to be honest with you but there's still like i'm trying to picture the audience and i can't do that you know what i mean yeah, like, like i i don't know even, who these people yeah, are yeah who but yeah, that's like who's who is this for? This isn't for the video game crowd because they're they're not going to care about this at all. No. No. We we barely do physical stuff as it is. I yeah. think it's more for the people who make the YouTube funny clips and okay. just make compliment like uh, fodder to make fun of. This. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Okay. 
but yeah, I don't know. Like I saw this and I was just like, wow, that but, looks really bad. <laughs> but, but, but also look at this show like as a, hey, they know their audience because as you said, we watched Nick or Nickelodeon back yeah. in the day as <laughs> kids that seeing something like this is basically just trying to speak to our generation and just say, hey, at some point there was American gladiators for, yeah. for oh, back yes. then, right? And yeah. now we're having this, whereas like as kids, we watched it and was like, oh, that's amazing. There should be a video game made out of American gladiators. And there was Didn't some iteration. Yeah, there, there, was, there were American Gladiators games on the NES and Super Nintendo. Right. And they were, they were I not had good. one of those too. <laughs> but now you can clearly see the popularity of video games is starting to roll reverse here. Because yeah. you see a generation of people that were kids that played Frogger and they understand that reference, kind of like Captain America and be like, I understand that reference. <laughs> I understand that reference. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? But then you put on a game show and it just draws that crowd in because that's who we are in this generation. We play video games and and, so, and some of the older crowd is having a really hard time understanding that. Like, man, I thought you got you kids okay. would have been away from that already. Okay, so Joe, do you do you have Peacock? I do not. Mel? No. Okay, I don't either. So I will say this. If this shows up on the free plan for Peacock. I'll check it out, but I if, if this is behind their like paywall, like their monthly fee, it's like nah. Like this is this is yet something else that I I don't need to watch. I think there was know? something at the end of the trailer about saying something uh, needing a paid subscription. Oh yeah, oh like the the fine print or whatever. Yeah, yeah. Oh, if you go to the end, I think with us. Yeah, I find it hilarious that I freeze framed it on this little this little frame here because it okay, just wait shows... Okay, wait a minute. The white dude looks like David, David Hoff, Hasselhoff's Yeah, it's child. kind of weird. Like, I can't like, pinpoint I where he's from. Chad, if you know where he's from, because I don't even know who that is. But At I know... First, I thought he looked like a character from Lucifer. Now I can see David Hasselhoff for yeah. some reason. But so, you can clearly see how happy they are to host this. So Peacock this is, is five bucks a month. <laughs> That's not bad. Peacock, yeah, it's it's five bucks a month or ten bucks a month without ads. Mm, so you're you're automatically already paying for it's basically it's basically YouTube Premium. Yeah. yeah, you're not paying for ads here. But yeah, this is like I said, this I just but then I saw this but then I, I like, hope yeah. they're not like Hulu where they still show you ads even though you pay for the premium in between segments. Mm. Yep, they do that. That's so stupid. It's like. I'm paying for you. I've already given you my money and you're still selling. HBO even does this, I believe. It's terrible, man. Oh, yeah. 